Hello guys, I hope that you are doing well. If you are looking to generate videos from text on just 10 GB of VRAM, then this model COG Video X 5 billion might be your friend. I already have covered this model, its architecture and all the story behind it in its previous version, not the previous version, another variant, 2 billion parameter model just 8 days ago. And you can check it out on the channel by just searching with COG Video X and you will see that we already have installed this 2 billion model locally and have generated videos from text for free with this model and the quality is really amazing if you go to its model card they also have presented some of the prompts and the videos for example look at this one let me play it a bit there you go so it's six second video it generates and look at that and this is a prompt they have used similarly look at this one how good is that looks so real but this is all being generated six second video by ai so if you have a 3090 card something like that 10 gb of vram then you can easily get this model installed and in this video i'm going to show you a step-by-step -step tutorial as how can you get this model installed on your local system before i show you the installation let me give a huge thank you to mast compute for sponsoring the vm and gpu for this video if you are looking to rent a gpu on affordable prices i will drop the link to their website in video's description plus i'm also going to give you a coupon code of 50 percent discount on a range of gpus so this is my ubuntu system let me quickly show you my version and stuff so this is ubuntu 22.04 which i'm using and this is my gpu card nvidia rtx a6000 with 48 gp of vram let me clear the screen first up let's create a virtual environment i'm just calling it cog with python 3.11 make sure that you use python version from 3.10 to 12 i would say go for 3.11 as it matches with its a uh, lot of packages well so let's wait for this conda environment to get created and then we will proceed further and the conda environment is created next let's install some of the prerequisites so we are installing torch here pytorch and then we are installing transformers library diffuser accelerate and ffmpeg and we are installing most of them from the source so diffuser is a library for generating and manipulating images and text using diffusion models and ffmpeg is a multimedia framework for processing encoding decoding and streaming audio and video files so let's run it this is going to take a bit of a time because it is installing from source so let's wait for it to finish and then we will proceed further everything is installed took fair bit of time around five minutes so let's be patient with it next up let's launch our jupyter notebook it is going to launch it in the browser so that we would be able to play it in the browser window in our notebook so let's wait for it to get launched so our jupyter notebook is launched let's import the libraries and also get the model and then we are also enabling this visual auto uh, sorry variational auto encoder the vae v generates new synthetic data which is images text similar to the original data it was trained on it learns to compress and reconstruct data enabling the application like image generation data augmentation anomaly detection and dimensionality reduction so a lot of things it does so let me run it it is going to import the libraries and then it is going to download the model so it has started downloading the model you can see that the size is not that big for a video text to video model there are only two tensors and the size is under 10 gig so let's wait for it to finish it the pipe is going to download both uh, the model and the, that sort of stuff sentence piece is also being downloaded tokenizer is there so let's wait for it to finish and the model is now downloaded and loaded on to our gpu let's do the inference with it so here first i'm defining this prompt let me actually make it fit onto this screen so there you go so i have just converted it into multi-line here we are simply creating a diffusion model pipeline we are specifying our prompt in this pipe and then after that we are just giving it 
uh, one video per prompt and then we are saying that video quality is just 50 i mean because these are the number of inference step number of frames i'm just specifying 49 frames so this is the length of the video and then guidance scale is pretty interesting it is adjusting the realism versus creativity the more higher the value the more creative realistic it will be generator is uh, is simply a torch dot generator this just sets the random seed for reproducibility for CUDA devices and then I'm just exporting uh, the video so but if you have a very high good quality GPU like a100 and that sort of stuff you can increase the guidance scale up to 12 or you could increase the inference steps up, up till 100 up to you okay so now let me run it it is going to export the video so you can see that it is now doing the inference steps it is going to take a bit of a time so let's wait for it to finish okay so it is almost there but let's uh, meanwhile try to read this prompt the prompt says a young be spectacled fox wearing a tiny top hat and holding a miniature violin stands on a moss covered stone in a whimsical moonlit garden the fox bushy tail swishes gently as it draws the bow across the strings creating enchanting ethereal melodies surrounding the fox fireflies dance and twinkle like tiny stars while nearby raccoons rabbits and squirrels gather mesmerized by the performance soft shimmering mist rises from the garden's winding paths and vibrant flowers bloom in every color of the rainbow the fox's face shines with passion and delight as it loses itself in the music amidst this magical dreamlike setting so let's see what it produces quite uh, excited about it let's wait for it almost there and you can see that it has almost taken around um, six minutes and few seconds almost there so it is now exporting the video and the model has generated the video as you can see let me play it and there is a video it has generated and look how good is that there is a fox and then yeah, sorry this is not the fun this is from another video so let me play it again the output.mp4 there you go how good is that six second video amazing okay that's cool let's try out another one so let me go to my browser now in the next one and i'm going to play it so that we could also check it out so a ravishing blonde girl draped in a flowing silk gown with intricate lace details sits atop a majestic a gleaming white horse amidst a breathtaking sunset kissed tuscan landscape uh, her piercing blue eyes sparkle as she gently brushes the horse's mane while a delicate golden crown woven with wild flowers flowers adorns her effortless and all that stuff cypress trees gentle breeze cylinder fingers hold a delicate crystal violin poised to unleash a, unleash a melodic symphony that harmonizes with nature's splendor so let's see what it produces let me scroll down so there you go around eight minutes or so so let's wait for it to finish and the video is generated now it is exporting it to the mp4 on my local system and that is done let me open that file this is the output one let's open it there you go how good is that how realistic that looks the violin is a bit odd and you can see that the okay, sorry this is crazy let me put it in a new folder so that we'll be able to look at okay so look at this one again you see um, the violin and hand uh, coordination is not good enough okay, I'm not sure why I think it is just going uh, into the loop around there but if I just play it again in a new folder looks good but still a lot of improvement right so because the hand coordination is not good enough uh, but other than that it gives us uh, still a lot of improvement with this model here no problems at all amazing even the whole background is really great so that's it guys let me know what do you think i hope that you enjoyed it if you have any questions let me know if you like the content 
please consider subscribing to the channel if you're already subscribed please share it among your network as it helps a lot thanks for watching